everyone, welcome back to another Yes Style haul. So as always, everything that I try on in this video will be linked down below and use my code LOVEYIRENE all caps for a discount off of your order. So let's just get straight into it. We're not going to get into the nonsensical stuff today. <laughs> so this shirt is also from Yes Style and it's actually really cool because I thought it would just come in single layered with the illusion of it being double layered, but it's literally double layered and I think it's really nice. Okay, so like the sleeves are one single layered, but the other ones are not. So I think it's really cool in that sense. It's not cropped at all. It's actually definitely long. Now I am wearing a high waisted pair of jeans, but it goes down till here. So definitely not cropped at all and really nice for a fall kind of vibe. This color was supposed to be matcha and I think it's a little bit, it's a little bit darker than a matcha color, but I do really like it. Okay, the next thing here is um, like this cardigan. I feel like I need a white shirt to wear underneath, so let's go grab that. This white shirt is also from YesStyle. I actually wear it very often just because how soft it is and it's really easy to layer with this shirt because it's so tight to your skin. You can literally see my watch bulging out of there. Okay, um, this cardigan is actually also similar to the texture that this shirt is in because it really just sticks to your skin rather than being a little bit more oversized, I guess you could say. You know, there's like two different cardigans, the lightweight ones and then the more so thicker ones, and this is one of the lighter ones. So you can tie it in the middle like that, and it's actually not cropped, which is great, because then you can just wear it with anything and it still looks good. Yeah, because sometimes when cardigans are um, cropped and you're wearing a not cropped shirt underneath, it looks a bit odd. But I would definitely style like this as it is and maybe throw something on so that I'm a little bit more warmer. But the sleeves are a bit longer than what I anticipated so I'd probably roll them up inside. And yeah, that's what it looks like. It also has these little holes that you may be able to see. So probably better for summer but I feel like you could make it more versatile and wear it in the winter as well or even fall. Now this vest, I actually have the same thing in green. It's kind of like a mint green along with the yellow I believe it is. It's like right up there. But I wanted another one just because I feel like I really like that vest. I wanted more vests in different colors. I don't have a vest that's in this shade of purple so this is what it looks like. I almost look like someone that's supposed to be doing basketball. I don't know, I think the colors just really give basketball vibes. This one is not cropped at all either. So that is very nice and your normal vest, what could I say? And then the next thing is also this cardigan. And I just mentioned that there's two different types of cardigans, the lighter ones, which we just tried on, and then more so the thicker ones. And wow, what amazing foreshadowing that was. But we're gonna try this thicker, cardigan as well. There's nothing too too special about this but I saw the reviews and they're really good and I think the material soft maybe that's why it's just like a comfortable cardigan to wear. Let's try it on. Okay so I really like this cardigan because the sleeves are actually shorter than what you would expect and I feel like this is perfect for my short arm armed girlies because I always have stuff that are too long for me, like the um, lighter green cardigan that we just tried. It's a little bit too long, but this one is actually the perfect size. And I can definitely see why there were a lot of good reviews because it's very soft, it's very comfortable, exactly what I anticipated. Okay, let's just pretend like I did all the buttons, but it's not cropped at all. And this is what it looks like. I think it's just like a really cute cardigan. Now this is more of a matcha color, I would say, rather than this, like the contrast is quite there. This is more like matcha plus chocolate or coffee but yeah this is what it looks like i love how there's a bit of a puff to the sleeves but not necessarily a too much of a puff so there's something unique about that okay you could say like the theme of this video is more so for knitwear so that's what i was trying to target oh my god my sister has started playing violin oh no anyway are we surprised here yet another cardigan so this one is a black cardigan with hearts it's also got kind of a checkered print to it so I honestly really like it. You know a lot of people try to wear cardigans like that so that they can make it off shoulder, which I think is kind of weird. But anyway, this is how it looks like. It's not cropped. I don't know why I feel the need to say that every single time, but I think it's just like a really nice um, cardigan. I wouldn't perhaps wear it with white. I'll probably layer it with a black shirt inside just because I feel like that would suit the vibe better. Or even like a gray shirt would be nice, but that's just my two cents on that. It, it's really nice and the... It's not embroidered, if you think that's what it was, it was just like knitted on there, but it's really cute and I don't have a cardigan that is similar to this in it anyway. My darker cardigans are typically more so like checkered prints, but this is not that, so I really like it. 
yet again another cardigan i actually don't have any cardigans in this color so i thought it would be nice to have like a neutral tone cardigan it's almost brown but not really and this one is most definitely cropped even with my crop jeans like it ends perfectly there which i really like and i think this is just a really staple fall moment i think yeah i don't know how you would actually layer this just probably with a jacket but it's very soft and i don't even know if i could actually wear something underneath because of how sticking to the skin it is rather than it being more so of an oversized i'm already getting hot because the heater is on and the sun is down but i don't know i don't know why it's typically really hot in here or cold i meant to say cold in the winter at least so that's the case now let's move on to some of the accessories that i got so let me just sit properly i've been sitting on my legs and it hurts okay so this one is a ring light that i got because i wanted to test out different like ring lights i did have one in the past but it just wasn't good enough and this one i think will work a little bit better okay so look at me go quite literally the engineer. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ooh, okay. So you can play around with the levels. I'm gonna have it just face normally for now though. Is that normally? No, it's not. You know it's pretty obvious how you connect a ring light to this kind of usb cord so how about we just try it on right now and i'll show you guys my makeup products with this ring light okay let's move areas though because this is not the best place for me to plug in something Ooh, you just saw my messy floor we're not letting you see that oh my god the camera work is going off right now okay all right we have arrived at my seat and this is how we're going to present. Yeah, that looks good. Water. Would you like a sip? Take some if you would like. Oh my goodness, that's really nice. Okay, so this is what it looks like right now. I'm going to show you guys my makeup products. I feel like a real beauty YouTuber. <laughs> I'm having my beauty YouTuber moment. Actually, I'm going to check up to see if it's weird or not okay so i kind of moved it to the side and i feel like this looks better in some way okay living my true beauty youtuber movement it actually just stays still by itself okay you can see <laughs> looks like i have blush on but i really don't okay so the next thing we have is this peripera thing and it is a volume clearing black volume clur cl clearing curling black mascara so basically a mascara and i love the design it makes me want to use it even though i don't use mascara okay this one is amuse and i'm pretty sure silky really really worked with amuse for a while i think that was like last year or so okay anyway this is a fixing um vegan cushion in the color number two nude yes i'm nude dun, 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 dun okay anyway this one is the etude fixing tint bar and this one also has really pretty packaging like i love the packaging when it comes to korean skincare or beauty products amazing and then the very last thing that i have before we move move on to the next segment of the video is a mood it fell i'm sure you could hear that okay just put it back up to be fair i am balancing it on a piece of paper so probably not the most flat surface you could find but the next thing is that's holika holika mood eye glitter and matte moony it says whatever that means so that is it for this yes style haul everything's linked down below now let's move on to the next part of the video hi everyone i'm back with the second part of the haul and we're going to get through a lot of stuff a lot of clothes and a lot of miscellaneous stuff so how about we begin with the clothes so this first thing i recently wore for a video i haven't worn it outside but i really like it i thought it was going to be originally a little bit too big but i think it's fun because it's this top here and it's almost like tweed vibes but there is it's not really tweed, but I'll show you how it looks. So this is what the top looks like. It does have a ribbon that is not so much in shape, but I do like it. You know, the puff sleeves, the slight puff sleeves are a nice addition. And it's not cropped at all. Literally, I'm wearing my pajama pants, but um, 
Yeah, it's not cropped. Don't look at my pants. And <laughs> there's another ribbon down here as well. It's really cute. Honestly, I feel like this is more so of a fall weather type of thing, so maybe I'll wear it in the spring. No, spring. Spring works as well. So yes, the next thing I have with me is this top here, and this one is really popular on YesStyle, so I was like, maybe it's worth the hype. Let's try it out. And it is kind of like this. It's almost like a blouse, but it's almost like a summery kind of material where it's supposed to cool you. Probably not the best for this weather, but we're going to try it out and there's like different buttons and I've just seen so many people wear this so I thought I would give it a try as well. So let's try it on. Do you know how long I spent trying to get these buttons on? I wanted to wear a tank top that's black on purpose so I wanted to see like the see-through ability and it's pretty see-through. I mean that was pretty expected though and I thought these sleeves would almost be like a cinch sort of situation where you can make it tighter but that is not the case. I think the ribbons are on here just for aesthetics. I would tie them in the future, but not right now because I don't have time. I switched into actual pants, so do not worry. But it's kind of like this, where you can wear it like so, whereas like it shows a little bit of stomach action, but not really. So I think that's really nice, and I would most definitely wear this more so on warmer days, so it's a little bit nice. I feel like on winter days, this would be way too cold. But that's the case. Also, I'm not too sure how I feel about the black on the cream. Maybe not the best thing. So the next thing we're going to get into is this vest here. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but I also have a one in black. And I also wanted to get it in red because it's like a really soft vest. The other one too. I feel like this one is almost softer. And I thought the red one would be cute. Let's wear it with a black top and see how it looks. Honestly, I would wear it with a white top normally, but right now mine's in the wash, so there you go. Okay, so I would much rather have this in white, but you know, this still works, I think. So this top, or this vest, sorry, is not too, too cropped, but I feel like it's somewhere in the middle of cropped and pretty long. So this is what it looks like, pretty plain. It's almost giving Christmas. I wonder how it would look if I wore this with some green type of shirt, which I don't think I have. But I think I would look pretty ridiculous. But you know, festive season, am I right? Okay, the next thing I have is this tweed top. And this top is really nothing special. But I don't know, on the picture, the person that was wearing it, it looked really cute. So I want to try it on with a black top. That's kind of originally why I decided to wear this instead of white for this vest. Because, you know, it can be multi-purposeful. Oh, and there is a, there is a zipper on the back. So it is like sleeveless. Why do I look yellow? It's just the way the sun is situating on me. Um, anyway. Oh, but then I can't redo it by myself later. Well, we'll see. Let's try it on. And this is what it looks like. Um, it kind of looks like it's one with the shirt, but you guys know it's not. It's just like a separate sleeveless top like this. It's not too tight, I don't think. And I think it's actually the perfect size for me. It looks like this. It is quite cropped. I would probably wear it with a cropped shirt later on because this one is most definitely not cropped, so it kind of gives weird vibes and of course you could wear this separately without any top underneath but i would rather not <laughs> you know i feel like that's just like so risky why would you do that but this is what it looks like and let's move on to the next thing which is a black bolero so i have a white bolero and a blue bolero but i don't have a black one and i feel like this one might be versatile to wear with other outfits it's quite thinner than the other ones i have it's a little bit more like Ugh, like that <laughs> but let's see how it looks Maybe it wasn't the best decision to wear this with the black shirt, but I hope you can see the difference. So, this is what it looks like. The sleeves are quite long for me, but you know, it does the job. Also, I do have shorter arms than a normal person would. Also, I think generally, just the body part of this is a little bit too big for me. So, maybe a size down would be better, but I do feel like this was one size. And I don't really like when boleros keep like falling off, and I feel like this one will. But for aesthetics, it works. Like, this is what it looks like. Pretty much what you would expect in a bolero is what I got. Okay, so the next thing we're going to try on is, uh, oh, let's do this. This is just like a jacket. Honestly, I don't know why I got this because this is so not my style. I feel like you'll be able to see it. It's like those baseball jackets and it also has fleece. It's very soft is what I've got to say. But would I, where does I or all? I don't know. Also, I don't know what this says. Blocked? I don't know. Let's try it on. I'm literally yellow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, I feel like this is pretty much expected, but the sleeves are right for me. And it's kind of like an oversized vibe, but not really. Um, it's very much so giving sports, you know, like, uh, I don't know, baseball? 
Why did I buy this? I don't know. I feel like it looked really cute on the model and it was more so of a cream color. Um, if you compare them to my pants, they're most definitely not a cream color, which I'm a little bit disappointed, but I mean, it's pretty expected. Oof, sorry. Okay, <laughs> the next thing we're going to get into is this denim top. You guys know I love denim and I haven't taken the tag off, um, but uh, I really like it. And this one is supposed to tie, I think, around that. But honestly, I would prefer it without the tying. So let's see how it looks, how it looks when it's tied and everything like that. So I'm just gonna say, I really don't like this. It's also a little bit of a choking hazard, so let's just take that off and pretend that's not there. But this is what the top looks like. I feel like this part is a little weird because it ends kind of like higher than what it should be. And then the zipper though is really nice and it is a little bit tight because it's not a stretchy material, kind of like that tweed top that I wore earlier with the sleeveless. That one is a stretchy material while this one is just pure denim, which is my what you might be expecting. But it's really nice. I think it's pretty much what I expected. It's also cropped as you can tell. And yes, what more to say is it? I feel like I'm not very descriptive with these, but I feel like it's pretty much what you see, you know? That's why I watch hauls to see how they look rather than the person explaining it, unless there's something really important to be said. But that is pretty much it. Okay. <laughs> the next one we're going to get into is this very basic top that I've seen everywhere on Yes Style. And again, I just bought it because everyone has it. And there's also different colors on it. And I was really, really thinking of which color to get, but I just decided to go with this color. So let's try this on. And now this top is supposed to give you the illusion that there's like a shirt underneath when there isn't. So, you know, it does the job well and pretty much what you would expect. It is a little bit on the, what do I call it? More so of a wider side, I guess you could say. Um, but I feel like that's just like the whole purpose of it. And the like the neckline is quite wide as well. So it might like, you know, slip, but that's totally fine, I think, and it is on the crop side, as you can tell. So how about we just get into the next thing, which are pants. I have one pair, which I'm wearing right now, and I got it because it's unique in a sense. So there's this flower here. Can you see that? Yes. And then there's a, another flower here. And then there's another flower on my ankle and another one on my left ankle as well. Where'd that go? Oh, here. Okay, so these are what the pants look like. It is a little bit high-waisted, but, but not like too, too high-waisted. And um, they are perfect for my legs, which is perfect. And it is a little, it, ah, can't talk. It's a little bit wide like it, but you know, I think I like it. I feel like I've gotten a lot of white pants recently, but I really do like white pants. And let's just get into the makeup products now. The sun is in my face, so I'm gonna tilt the angle so that you can see, oof, you know what, maybe not, maybe not. <laughs> so the first thing I got is this Ultra Facial Cream from the Village Factory. And then this one is really interesting because it's like a cake. It's so cool. Um, I don't know if I can show you, but there's like a cake inside and it's supposed to be a cake cushion. It's so cute. I want to use it, but I don't use cushions. That's the thing. So I feel like this would be great for a birthday gift gift because it's literally shaped like a cake as seen here and you can just open it and use it as a yeah okay um the next thing i have is this um shadow oh shading so this is basically just like a why can't i think of it <laughs> i watch beauty tutorials all the time like you know like where you used to and it's like more of a darker color. I forgot the name. Okay. <laughs> and the last thing that I have is this. Did I show one of these in my past videos? Hmm. Okay, well, this is the glitter. And I think I showed this in the past. I'm not entirely sure. But I got these things. Okay. And then the next thing I got are these tips for my Apple Pen. Because apparently if you use these, it's better for you and it won't destroy your apple pen and there's a lot in this and i was just expecting one or two okay and then another thing i got is this mini bag i really like it it's very mini as you can tell i didn't expect it to be this small i've seen a lot of people use it and i thought it would be nice and then it also comes with this strap like so you can wear it like that but it's more of an off-white color rather than the cream color which is what the bag comes with which is a little bit odd, so I've decided just not to use it. And then the next thing, oh my god, this is probably 
the last for the best because it's this laptop sleeve oh i love it so much it's so cute and it's the padding is amazing the one i used before it was just okay but this one is like really thick and it's not too heavy either and it's just like really cute it says cherish you because the bear has a cherry on top so it's kind of like a pun i love it guys if you're planning on getting a laptop case i really really recommend this it's really nice um both for aesthetics and also for usability okay so that is it for my yes style haul thank you so much for watching and use my code lovey irene all caps everything is in the description down below and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye